hi guys how are you welcome back to my channel so some of you guys have been asking me about the brushes that I use for lingerie and well in this tutorial I will show you how to find them how to download them how to import them and why not how to organize them so before we begin please don't forget to subscribe give a thumbs up click the bell and also don't forget that you can join my patreon I would appreciate it a lot you can also find the links to my other socials in the description box thanks for watching in advance and let's begin okay first thing you have to do is open clip studio paint on your computer you have to be logged in of course and then you have to go to this option clip studio assets as you can see it takes some time to load all the information as you can see you have a lot of recommended materials too drawing and painting comics and manga this is the one that I check the most uh, designs and patterns animation 3d for poses and well things like that and official clip studio paint materials this is very useful check this out and you'll find very interesting brushes so now how to search for a brush imagine that you want to find a brush for drawing lingerie in this case so we I always look for lace and brush press enter and there you have a lot of different brushes you can of course download the one that you like the most some of them are some of them can be exchanged with gold because we have like different currencies in the program you have the clippies CP you have of course the free brushes and you have the gold currency which is the most expensive one if I'm not wrong I have never bought any clippies or gold the ones that I have for clippies that I will show you later are I got them when well sometimes clip studio does this um, login uh, rewards thing so I got some clippies there and that's it but I always download brushes for free because as you can see I have no gold or clippies okay now suppose that you liked for example mm, let's see this brush well I don't like clippies sorry um, one for free this brush you click the brush that you liked you press download well it takes some time as you can see so you download the brush and you will have like this pop-up uh, window here just click anywhere on the screen and it will disappear now if you go here you will see the brush that you have already downloaded uh, clip complete, completed transfers and you're done when you open the canvas go to the folder that you want to add the brush before that let's open let's make a new a new file new illustration here you can change like the 
canvas size I always use like the same and let's say that you want to add the brush in this category that I have it's named clothing add sub tool and you will see the brush that you have recently downloaded here you have all the downloaded material click here and add add palette right and now let's choose this color and there you have it very simple in this way you import the downloaded material you want here you can see for example that I have like download I have like all the downloaded material the recent downloaded material because I have like separate um, folders for each type of material I will organize my lace into this category lace so click and drag to the lace folder and if you want for example to make a new category here for your brushes just take the brush for example click and drag to the to this part and there you have like a subcategory uh, and that's it that's it for downloading and importing materials so every time you want to look for a brush just write for example line art and brush click uh, the space and enter and there you have like a lot of different line art brushes here you can download the one you like the most you have free for clippies and now I will show you my downloaded brushes so my favorite brushes I go if I go to download I have a favorite list, list too um, if I go to download I will show you the ones that as you can see well I have a lot of different brushes nine pages <laughs> A lot of uh, a pack of bows, very cute laces, laces. I have thousands of laces, different laces, but I will leave uh, the ones that I use the most in the description below, so you can download them uh, with the link. You have to log in into the Clip Studio webpage, and there you will be able to download. Every, one, every every single brush so for example the brushes that I use the most uh, you have seen me using in recent videos were these ones remember for the stockings texture uh, I will link the description the links in the description so you can get them these one these are the ones that I show you here these are the, the ones that I use the most then you add like this is for the base and then you can add like the lace you want this uh, well, have, I have a thousand different bases but I don't use them all I will also leave in the description this brush here that is very useful because as you can see it gives an interesting pattern to the to the lingerie and for brushes I will leave a link to the ones that I use the most so before we forget um, if you want to make a new folder here for organizing your brushes you have to click here new folder and it will create a subfolder let's put just any other letter click enter and then drag here and there you have like a new folder so now if 
you go to download you can drag the brush to that folder for example this goes to background the same here so that was it i hope you find this video useful and thanks a lot to the people who leave comments uh, on my videos your suggestions help me to improve my tutorials video so thank you very much and that's it see you guys in the next video tutorial bye bye